Hey what's up guys welcome back to another day in life vlog So after last night's adventure I woke up pretty late at 5.40 in the morning And after that I had to rush to play badminton because everyone was already ready over there So I did not have any time to read in the morning or make any reasonable vlog regarding that So I am back from playing badminton it is about 8am So as you can see I am completely drenched in sweat I will have a quick shower and after that I need to order a few groceries and I need to make my breakfast and after that I will sit down and study I don't have to go to college today because we are currently in our preparation holidays the last one month before the final exam So I will be reading at home today Ok guys my bathing is done and my groceries are done I ordered some bread and milk for my breakfast Let's quickly make breakfast and head out to study my breakfast is ready but before that i need to edit this stress vlog so that it is uploaded on time after that i will start studying let's go so guys after cracking so many exams in my life to get to where i am right now i have realized that it is very important to stay consistent and do little amount of work every day rather than burdening yourself with too much work in one day and feeling burnt out Ever since my NEET, UG, NEET, PG, and right now the PG preparation days, this little bit of consistency every day has come a long way. Rather than trying to do too much in one day and then feeling burnt out and wasting the next day and the day after. So, guys, all these exams I feel are like a marathon. Therefore, you need to maintain a constant pace and need to run for a longer time rather than thinking of it as a sprint. Of course, it can be a sprint and it is a sprint. when needed that is right before the final last week of the exam or last two days before the exam at that time you need to think of it as a sprint and give it all you got but try to think about these exams as marathon and try to stay consistent and do the repetitive task every day in and out back to the vlog so after trying out some new angles for my youtube vlog i get back to studying and do few more minutes of reading this is me using a pomodoro technique to squeeze in those extra 25 minutes of study before i take a walk to get some fresh air before realizing that it is too hot outside and no one is actually present well today i have a function to attend therefore i was feeling a little bit of sleepy because i woke up so early today so i take 30 minutes of nap before getting ready and heading out to the function who am i kidding i'm here for this after enjoying the buffet in the function i come back to study but i realize that i'm too sleepy therefore i take a quick nap and after waking up i get back to the grind and i try to complete few more chapters After that it is almost 9 pm now my gym closes at 10 pm so I quickly get ready and head out to the gym after that I come back and I do a little bit of editing for tomorrow's video along with that I drink buttermilk because I have eaten too much in the function in the afternoon Hey guys so it is 12:30 pm and I have finally completed all the chapters in this book today so In the last chapter, my brain was not a hundred percent, so I think I just brushed through it. But uh, it's important to skip and move forward rather than get stuck at one particular point, and you just keep repeating that point every day, and there's so much to do. So that's it for this video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.